Making Great Maps, Data Visualization Principles. Making maps is both an art and a science, and there is a lot to think about in regards to design and analysis. Maps are simplifications of the real world, and so while you're unable to show everything, they can help reveal patterns and trends. Lastly, they are designed by people who have their own biases. In this example, we see multiple maps all using similar symbology, but showing different variables to argue where the location of a highway connector should be placed. In the first map, the County Chamber of Commerce uses this map to argue that the connector should be placed in an area where the property values are low. In the second map, a community group argues that the connector should not be placed in this area because it would cut off the African-American community from some of the resources that they use regularly. In the third map, the historical preservation group shows that this highway connector will run very close to the historic buildings and could adversely affect them. Finally, the business association also doesn't like the location of this connector and uses data on their map to show that traffic would be diverted away from the business district. When looking at these maps, keep in mind a few things. Only relevant features for a particular group were selected to be in each map. Each map was made by a different creator and trying to convey a different message. And each map is good for a different group. None are right or wrong. They're just conveying different messages.